Hello and welcome to another video for Midas Touch Toys, Games and Collectibles. And today we are looking at something very old and something very, very rare. We are looking at the 1984 release by AMT from their Star Trek The Motion Picture series of plastic model kits. Uh, and this particular one we are looking at today is of the Vulcan Shuttle which was seen in the uh, motion picture for a short time, which transported uh, Spock to the USS Enterprise. Okay, so this incidentally isn't the, the first release. The first release was released, released in 1979 at the same time as the movie was released. Um, and then this was the second issue, which is in 1984. Uh, okay, so this is the box it comes in. And the very top it's got the AMT and ERTL logo. And there you can see an image of the actual model itself or the item from the, the movie actually. That's the, the version as seen on the screen. And it says detachable shuttle metal model module. I'll get my words out. Let's do that again. Detach detachable shuttle model. Over 10 inches long assembled and display stand included. So Star Trek the Motion Picture Vulcan Shuttle. Copyright 1979 and 1984, Paramount Pictures Corp, all rights reserved. And it says unassembled model kit. And that, so that is the front of the box. Now what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna turn the box around and see what we got printed on the back. Okay, well as with all of these model kits, the back of the box is just completely blank. Um, so there's nothing on the box, on the back of the box to look at. But the side of the box has information. Um, and it says Star Trek the motion picture Vulcan shuttle featuring and it's got ERTL stock number 6679 supersedes AMT stock number S972 made in the US by the ERTL company and it's part number 6679-10EO and there if I just lift that up a little bit because the box is a little bit um, gone a little bit out of shape but it says over 10 inches long shuttle module separates from the warp drive sled which is that bit there uh, display on stand included or suspend in space okay so that's that side now if i'm just turn the box all the way around to the other side and there we have an image of the admiral himself and it says star trek the motion picture this kit is quality molded in a way which will allow the younger modeler to build an attractive replica without painting. If you wish to paint your model, follow these pictures for additional colors and details. Color of content subject to change, paint and the cement not included in kit. And it says copyright 1979-1984 Paramount Pictures Corporation, all rights reserved. And then you've got <clears throat> the RTL uh, logo there. And there's an image of William Shatner as Admiral Kirk. And here is the model kit um, as you would finish it and perhaps paint it. Okay, so that is the, that. Let's just turn it to the side. And on the side of the box, it says AMT ERTL, easy to assemble plastic model kit, plastic hobby kit, detachable shuttle model, over 10 inches long assembled, display stand included or suspend in space. Star Trek The Motion Picture 6679 Vulcan Shuttle. And I think it's exactly the same on the other side. Yes, it is exactly the same. So AMT, ERTL, easy to assemble, plastic hobby kit, detachable shuttle model, over 10 inches long assembled, display stand included or suspending space. Star Trek The Motion Picture 6679 and the Vulcan Shuttle and the image from the movie. Okay, that's the box. So let's open the box and have a look at what we got inside. Okay, well, as with all of these model kits, the back of the box is just completely blank. Um, so there's nothing on the box, on the back of the box to look at. But the side of the box has information. Um, and it says Star Trek, the motion picture, Vulcan shuttle featuring. And it's got ERTL stock number 6679, supersedes AMT stock number S972. Made in the US by the ERTL company. And it's part number 6679-10EO. And there, if I just lift that up a little bit, because the box is a little bit, um, gone a little bit out of shape. It says, over 10 inches long, shuttle module separates from the warp drive sled, which is that bit there. Uh, display on stand included or suspend in space. Okay, so that's that side. Now if I just turn the box all the way around to the other side, 
And there we have an image of the Admiral himself. And it says, Star Trek the motion picture, this kit is quality molded in a way which will allow the younger modeler to build an attractive replica without painting. If you wish to paint your model, follow these pictures for additional colors and details. Color of content subject to change, paint and the cement not included in kit. And it says copyright 1979, 1984 Paramount Pictures Corporation, all rights reserved. And then you've got <clears throat> the ERTL uh, logo there. And there's an image of William Shatner as Admiral Kirk. And here is the model kit um, as you would finish it and perhaps paint it. Okay, so that is that. Let's turn it to the side. And on the side of the box, it says AMT ERTL easy to assemble plastic model kit, plastic hobby kit, detachable shuttle model over 10 inches long assembled, display stand included or suspending space. Star Trek The Motion Picture 6679 Vulcan Shuttle. And I think it's exactly the same on the other side. Yes, it is exactly the same. So AMT, RTL, easy to assemble, plastic hobby kit, detachable shuttle model, over 10 inches long assembled, display stand included, or suspending space. Star Trek The Motion Picture 6679 and the Vulcan Shuttle and the image from the movie. Okay, that's the box. So let's open the box and have a look at what we got inside. Okay, so I've opened the box and this is what we've got. Let's first of all, let's have a look at the paperwork. So the, all the model kit is still sealed in the bag at the back. Um, and so it says Vulcan Shuttle, copyright 1979, 1984, Paramount Pictures, Corporation, all rights reserved, 6679. Okay, and it shows you how to do the, oh, there's tips on the building. Ooh, let's open it up there. So we've got uh, the decals there as well for the um, shuttle and the uh, attention modelers subscribe to the all new blue printer. I don't know what that's all about, um, but obviously something they were trying to sell at the time. And there we have the instructions on how to build the Vulcan shuttle. Um, so yeah, it's, so it's all piece by piece in actual fact there. So it looks like a quite simple kit to build. Um, and you've got a side view and left view there. Um, so yeah, it looks, it looks pretty much simple. So it tells you there to, to not glue it. Um, because it won't lift off if you do and then we have the assembled end here and it tells you where to put all the stickers and so on so this is manufactured by the rtl company under li exclusive license from paramount pictures corporation the trademark owner um okay and it's form number 0990532 okay so that is the instructions that's the blue printer model and that is uh, or uh, se uh, selling um, sheet and that is the stickers so the model kit well it's still sealed in the bag so I can't actually take it out I can tell you some of the items have come away from the sprue um, but you know you're talking 40 years old this model kit so I would expect some of the items to have come off but it, it's not a difficult model kit to build so I think the, you, the, the items that come off, you'll be able to identify quite easily. Um, we, we obviously know that's part of the stand and there's a base of the stand there. So yeah, I mean, it's, it looks like a very simple and very nice model kit to do. Um, and like it says on the box, it is designed also for the younger model builders to build. So it, I, it's obviously not too difficult. Okay, that is the model kit. <clears throat> Now, how well did these do? Well, like with all AMT model kits, um, they've all done very well, I think. I don't think there's a model kit that's never sold well. They produce them ma mass production. Although I haven't seen many of these Vul Vulcan shuttles around from the, uh, I don't think I've ever had a 79 one. Um, this is 84, we've had a few of these uh, and we currently have a few of these, um, but I, I don't think, uh, we, ne we haven't had any later ones either. So this is the, the uh, 1984 one, which I think is probably the best one because it is the one with a detachable shuttle. And I don't think the 1979 one shuttle uh, did detach. Um, but anyway, I've digressed. So this um, kit is now very rare and highly collectible and very difficult to find. But as usual, we are Midas Touch have managed to find a few, which are currently available to purchase on the Midas Touch website which you can get to quite simply by clicking the link below. It takes you straight to the website where you'll be able to find this and many other vintage Star Trek items. 
and many other vintage toys, games, and collectibles come to that. There's over 10,000 products currently available on the website for you to view and purchase at your leisure. And also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button because we are uploading videos for every new item that goes into the website. There will be something for everybody, and I'm absolutely positive you're not going to want to miss this because we literally have thousands and thousands of new items which we are shooting videos for and uploading on a daily basis. So if there is something in particular you are looking for, something old that you've never been able to find, something quirky you might want to buy for a friend, or maybe just something from your childhood that you'd like to own again to help you recuperate those long lost childhood memories. Well, stay tuned, keep watching, because you never know the next item we upload could be that item you've been looking for. Okay, that is it for me on this particular item. I hope you've enjoyed this very short video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again soon.